Well, <clears throat> hey, happy um, Sunday. I'm on my way to uh, Yoga. <clears throat> Thought I'd stop and have a little chat, which I like to do on Sundays. Anyway, hi. Um, namaste, motherfuckers. And I just want to reassure my um, LGBTIQ plus A um, compatriots. Don't worry about Target reducing the gay pride merchandise. It'll be fine. Apparently, Target, which has 2,000 department stores in the U.S., and where my husband and I shop all the time when we're in San Francisco because we love, I'm not showing it off, it's just we love Target. We just, we, they have everything. Children's clothes, and snacks, and plungers. And then during Gay Pride Month, everything turns rainbow. It's a big responsibility. As a gay, I've got to tell you, it's a, it's a lot of auditioning being gay now anyway. We've got to be on the right side of history or left or whatever that means. We've got to agree with, you know, mainstream liberal media or else we're shunned. There's that. But also, we've got to reassure the straight girls over drinks about all the sacrifices they've made and thank you. Now we're married and miserable like you. So the gay thing is a lot of responsibility. We don't need to also have to take inventory and be thankful for, you know, rainbow highball cups. Because when we're in Target during June, and Gay Pride Month is a month long, it's a lot. It, it, it takes that long to get our outfits together, but we don't need to also be worrying <clears throat> about whether or not Target has a Gay Pride, you know, doormat. That's my job. I'm the doormat in every relationship. Let me do that. I don't need a rainbow toilet plunger. Again, that's me. I'm the toilet plunger. Let me take that responsibility on. We don't need... <laughs> Hello. A rainbow thermometer. I can take the temperature of this room, motherfuckers. So, thank you, Target, for the A for effort. <coughs> Ooh, Bates. Thank you for the A for effort, but we don't really need all the stuff. In fact, reduce it to quality items. That'd be good. Reduce it just to things that are, you know, nice. Like, like that. Very nice. Size of width of his hips. I can get all my hands around them. How about that? How about a tiny hip doll? I'd like that. With a big rainbow outfit on. Or how about just back the fuck off, Target? It's fine what you've done for the last 10 years. Now it's, everyone's saying, oh, but it's about representation of the T's. The T's are making people nervous, so they're reducing our quantity at <laughs> Target. That's the concern. That's what we're worried about. I think the T's will be fine. Because at Target, they got men's stuff, they got women's stuff, they got, <laughs> that's whatever. So they'll be fine. They got the whatevers. So the tees will be fine with the whatever. I don't mind a straight guy wearing a bit of makeup or a skirt. Easy to catch. As Sue Murphy used to say in her act, you know, there's a lot of straight guys in this room that wouldn't do badly with a bit of rouge and eyeshadow. It's called a makeover. Don't be threatened. And all that's still available at Target. It's all still there. All the colors of the rainbow, just not as a rainbow. So, uh, see you in June. Unless you see me first, apparently. Because slowly but surely, I'm canceling myself. Talk later, bye.